this is probably the simplest way you can animate your button icon in Qt. I hope your day is going well, my name is Hamisi and this is Spin TV. I am going to show you how you can animate your Qt button icon, but before we do that, let's grow this channel together and reach more audiences, you can help me achieve that by simply hitting that like button and subscribing. This is a PyQt, PySide, and Python tutorial, so if you're new, please start by watching the first videos in this playlist, or click on the link above. In our next tutorial, I will be showing you how you can fully customize your buttons and animate them in the simplest way possible. I have already built and simplified all the critical parts, so you will only be passing a few lines of code to achieve this look in animations. You can choose to either animate the border, background, or both. You can also add an animated icon. These animations will be triggered by hovering over the button or clicking on the button. All the instructions to customize your button can be passed using a JSON file or through your function statements. This source code is already available for my Patreon supporters, it will be available to everyone once I publish the video. You can customize your button animation duration, easing curve, choose the button theme, or you can pass in your custom theme colors. You can also choose to apply the default settings to all buttons, instead of customizing each individually. I will leave the source code download link below. We will start by creating a simple user interface with a single push button, then export the Python code for the UI. The next step is to create the main.py file, export the UI file, then create the main class. This is how the interface looks like. Now we will need to install the Econify library which we will be using to animate the icons, I will leave this link below. After that, download the icons libraries by running the following command. Once the download is complete, run the following command to view all the icons you've just downloaded. These are all the icons, from this window, you can view, customize and copy the icon name to your clipboard. Now let us apply the icon to the push button on the main window, we need to import the Econify library, before passing the icon to the button.
Now let us change the icon color and add the animation. You can visit this page and view all the examples they've provided which will help you to further understand the Econify library. That's all for this tutorial, thank you for watching, if this video was helpful to you, please leave a like and a comment below to show some love. I will see you in the next episode.